Okay, so this is a simple problem just to um, show you how to use intersection. That's what this is called, intersection. Uh, union, that's what this is, union. And these guys here, um, this is usually called uh, set minus, set minus. All right, so let's find the intersection first. So A intersection B, so solution. A intersection B. This is everything in A and everything in B. Um, that means everything they have in common. So in this case, it uh, looks like they don't have A in common, but they have B, C, and D. B, C, and D are both in A and in B, so that's just going to be B, C, D. So that part is done. Right? So it's the only things they have in common. Right? So uh, you see little a is in capital A, but it's not in B, so we don't include that. Likewise, little e and little f are in capital B, but they're not in A. So it's just what they actually have in common. So it looks like B, C, and D work. All right, A union B. By definition, this means everything in A or everything in B or both. So, or you can just say everything in A or everything in B, where you assume that or in mathematics allows for that possibility of both cases. So we just write everything down, A, B, C, D, E, F. So that's how you find the union, uh, A union B. Let's look at A set minus B. So this is everything in A, but not in B. Well, we know B, C, D are both in A and B, so the only thing in A that is not in B is little a. So A set minus B is just the set containing little a. All right, now let's look at B set minus A. So this is everything in B that's not in A. So let's see, E and F, right? E and F, those are the only two things that are inside B that are not in A, right? So E and F are in B, but they're not over here. So that's it. Um, that's just a quick video to show you um, just some basic operations with sets. That's it.